39 albums. Does that make you yeah, pause? That's, I, I, I mean, I wasn't counting, but uh, <laughs> I've read that and sounds about right. <laughs> Before we even get to the new music, bigger news to share. You are going to be a grandpa. I am. In February sometime, yeah. Bubba and Tamara expecting? They are. I'm very excited. Norma's really excited. Everybody says being a grandparent's the greatest thing, and, and I'm sure it will be. What are they going to call you? Uh, that's a good question. We've been kind of kicking those around. I like granddaddy. I had a granddaddy, and I had a papa, too. So, you know, either one of those is good or whatever this the, the, the little kid Critter is going to call you. Know, you. <laughs> you, know, he, you never know. It's actually more fun to let him come yeah, up with it. it probably will be. Or her. Mm -hmm. Well, I think it's him. Oh. Yeah. They're, they're pretty sure. Wow. Yeah. Big news being yeah. shared by George Strait. I'm not going to lay around and whine and moan because somebody done done me wrong. Here for a good time. A lot of these songs actually come from the collaboration between Bubba, your longtime songwriting pal Dean Dillon, and yourself. What has the songwriting collaboration between the three of you and between just you and your son done for you as an artist is it kind of press the refresh button a little bit for you maybe a little bit yeah you know I used to write a long time ago back in early in my career I, I used to enjoy writing and I didn't record that many songs that I wrote has your songwriting grown yeah well you know it, it for so many years it was absent it was just you know I just didn't really even have the desire or motivation to write and then uh, when Bubba started uh, wanting to get into it. He called me one night, I was at the ranch, and he called me and said, hey Dad, I think I wrote a pretty good song. And it's called Arkansas Dave. It was a long road for Arkansas Dave. He shot and left him where he lay. Played me a little bit of it on the phone. And I said, that sounds pretty good, Bob. I can't wait to hear it when, we, when I see you. He said, well, we should write some together. I said, okay, I'll, I'm for that. And so we started writing, and then one day I said, you know what, we need to get Dean down and write with Dean some. That would be a lot of fun for you and me. Yeah. That's how that all came about, and I, I'm, you know, I'm really fired up about writing again, and it's been a lot of fun, and I'm very proud of the songs that we were able to write for this record, and hopefully we'll continue to, to write some more. Writing now, does it make it wish you had had such a big gap between your songwriting sessions? Well, I do. You know, sessions? I wish I would have uh, taken the time to write more during my career. Um, but uh, I have no regrets that, you know, I was finding great songs by great writers in Nashville. And and it was it was really good for me then, and it was good for them. And, you know, I've always thought that, you know, whether I'm writing or not, you know, I've got to pick the best songs, yeah. whether they're mine or... You know, I'm not just going to sing them because I wrote them. You know, I've got to find the best songs to make the best record that I can make. I ain't here for a long time. I'm here for a good time. I think this, all of these songs deserve to be on the record. I mean, I really do. I think yeah. they, they're, uh, they're good songs. And so, you know, but, I, but that's my feeling and that's the way it'll always be. I'm not going to sit here and say that I'm going to write all the songs for the next record. I might, but then again, I might not. They've got to be good. What kind of sense of pride do you have as just a father sitting down and writing songs and creating music with your son? I'm very proud of Bubba and the fact that, that he's uh, taken an interest in the music business like his old dad. So <laughs> it's rewarding for me and to be able to sit down and, and, and write with him and then, and then have him come out on a record. You know, that's, we joked last time we spoke because a couple of his songs made the last project, mm -hmm. and I said the entire songwriting community is going to have a bounty on his head. <laughs> and now you come out, and there's seven of them on this record. But instead, they just want to write with him. So. Yeah, now, <laughs> now he's the hottest songwriter in Nashville. Well, one of the collaborations is the title track here for a good time. Yeah. Do you want to talk about how this one came about? Well, it, it was Bubba's idea. You know, he came to the the way Dean and I and Bubba do it. You know, we just we go book several days somewhere and we meet up and come with our ideas and uh, throw them out there and see which ones we feel like writing and that was the I think the first one we wrote and it was uh, Bubba said what do you got oh Dean said what do you got Bubba and he goes well I like this uh, I'm not here for a long time I'm just here for a good time ding yeah exactly <laughs> and uh, so we that's how that was started I ain't here for a long time I'm here for a good time. 